and we're back in the yard. So we have a pain heat pump here. I'm gonna show you how to test the defrost cycle on this guy. Uh, same goes for carrier units or pretty much anything that's carrier. Uh, they're all pretty much the same. So there's a couple things that uh, we're gonna to wanna to find on this board, uh, which is our defrost board. So uh, here we go. We wanna find the speed up pin. So this is gonna be our tester. And then we also wanna find the DFT, which is this pink wire here, okay? Now, right here, this is our timer. So this guy is set to check to see if the defrost thermostat has been uh, closed every 60 minutes. So what this does is that's, this speeds up that timer so we can test it. However, this needs to be closed because this is a normally open uh, switch. So when it closes and the timer hits, it's gonna go ahead and engage the defrost. So we're gonna speed that process up. So we're gonna go ahead and unplug this. All right, and just set that aside. We're gonna take our jumper and the two pins in there, we're gonna basically jump those two together, like so. All right, and just make sure nothing's touching there. And then now we're gonna take a screwdriver in common, and these two speed up pins, we're gonna to touch them together with our screwdriver. Okay, so by doing this, we're speeding up that timer. So usually it takes 60 minutes to check to see if it's closed. But by doing this, we're fast forwarding it basically. So it's gonna, there it goes, and then take it off. And now it's gonna run into defrost. Now, I'm not sure exactly for carrier how long it'll run into defrost, but generally it's gonna be 10 minutes or until the uh, defrost thermostat has closed. So pretty much if we remove this, it'll go back into heat mode. Cause now it thinks that the defrost thermostat has closed. So that's how you test the uh, defrost mode make sure your defrost board's working if for some reason it doesn't do that then there's probably something up with the defrost or the defrost thermostat so anyway thanks for watching make sure you like and subscribe comment tell me what a horrible technician i am and hit that bell notification and follow me on instagram and facebook and don't forget to plug that back in thanks for watching